Well, we are now just a few days away from the 12th annual 26.2 with Donna, the only marathon in the country dedicated to finishing breast cancer. And we are your home of all the live coverage on Sunday. You know, a lot of the participants have a special reason for running this race. And tonight, Arlana Harris continues our Why I Run series as we introduce you to one woman who caught her own breast cancer by complete chance. We are going to go, as usual, across the street. They say the road of life twists and turns. Left on 1st Street to Atlantic Beach. But for Andy Sharp, the turn was more of a nosedive. Yeah. See, she's used to taking care of other people. I am an emergency physician and palliative care physician at Mayo Clinic. But then her life took a turn. Had felt something uh, in my breast. Thing is, breast cancer is something she never thought she'd run into. I don't have any risk factors for breast cancers, no family history. But three weeks later, she got a mammogram and a twist. Interestingly, what they found was not what I was feeling at all. The lump she found turned out to be nothing, but just seeing the doctor's reaction, she knew something wasn't right. The way the radiologist spoke to me was a way in which I speak to patients when I'm not ready to give them a definitive diagnosis. And that harmless lump led them to find an early stage of breast cancer. It was interesting when I was diagnosed to have to sit in that setting with both patients and then as a person going through treatment. But it gave her a whole new perspective. I knew that in two months from the end of my radiation, I would be able to be back and doing the things that I like to do. There were other people as I sat in those treatment rooms who didn't have that confidence. And all those twists and turns led her down a whole new path. That's where Bouncy Hunters was born. With Bouncy Hunters, Andy and her group run in the Donna for all the people fighting breast cancer who can't. Every one of us are going to be challenged by a diagnosis of breast cancer. It'll be your mother, your friend, your sister, your niece, and we're hunting for a cure. I like that the bounty hunters they're going to be collecting gently used athletic shoes throughout February to donate to underserved countries with all the proceeds going to the Donna Foundation and we have info on where you can donate on our website just head to firstcoastnews.com.